Wisdom from Proverbs chapter 3. Don't assume you know it all. This will be good. Good friend, don't forget all I've taught you. Take to heart my commands. They'll help you live a long, long time, a long life lived full and well. Don't lose your grip on love and loyalty. Tie them around your neck. Carve their initials on your heart. Earn a reputation for living well in God's eyes and the eyes of people. Trust God from the bottom of your heart. Don't try to figure out everything on your own. Listen for God's voice in everything you do, everywhere you go. He's the one who will keep you on track. Don't assume that you know it all. Run to God. Run from evil. Your body will glow with health. Your very bones will vibrate with life. Honor God with everything you own. Give Him the first and the best. Your barns will burst. Your wine vats will brim over. But don't, dear friend, resent God's discipline. Don't sulk under His loving correction. It is the child He loves that God corrects. A father's delight is behind all of this. Verse 13. The very tree of life. You're blessed when you meet Lady Wisdom, when you make friends with Madam Insight. She is worth far more than money in the bank. Her friendship is better than a big salary. Her values exceed all the trappings of wealth. Nothing you could wish for holds a candle to her. With one hand she gives life, with the other she confers recognition. Her manner is beautiful, her life wonderfully complete. She is the very tree of life to those who embrace her. Hold her tight and be blessed. With Lady Wisdom, God formed earth, and Madam Insight, He raised heaven. They knew when to signal rivers and springs to the surface and dew to descend from the night skies. Never walk away, verse 21. Dear friend, guard clear thinking and common sense with your life. Don't for a minute lose sight of them. They'll keep your souls alive and well. They'll keep you fit and attractive. You'll travel safely. You'll neither tire nor trip. You'll take afternoon naps without worry. You'll enjoy a good night's sleep. No need to panic over alarms and surprises or predictions that doomsday's just around the corner because God will be right there with you. He'll keep you safe and sound. Never walk away from someone who deserves help. Your hand is God's hand for that person. I'm gonna read that one again, that's really good. Never walk away from someone who deserves help. Your hand is God's hand for that person. Never tell your neighbor, maybe some other time, or try me tomorrow when the money's right there in your pocket. <laughs> Don't figure ways of taking advantage of your neighbor when he's sitting there trusting and unsuspecting. Don't walk around with a chip on your shoulder, always spoiling for a fight. Don't try to be like those who shoulder their way through life. Why be a bully? Why not, you say? Because God can't stand twisted souls. It's the straightforward who get his respect. God's curse blights the house of the wicked, but He blesses the home of the righteous. He gives proud spectics a cold shoulder, but if you're down on your luck, He's right there to help. Wise living gets rewarded with honor. Stupid living <laughs> gets the booby prize. I love that. Don't get the booby prize. Listen to some wise wisdom from Proverbs chapter 3. And I would love to answer any questions you may have about faith in Jesus. You can contact me through my website, nancyjoytoyou.com. I hope you have a blessed day living for Him.